what's good youtube fam as you can see i'm coming at y'all again with um another tutorial i told you i was going to do all the um uh wet well color icon trio palettes and i'm going to be doing a tutorial on the i'm getting sunburnt which is this palette right here and as you can see my nails are done last um haul video i believe that i did the one before last i told you i bought that nail kit because i wanted to do my nails and i have done them so these are my acrylics they are done thank goodness my house is smelling like straight nail shop so anyway yes those they are done if y'all want well i don't know how we'll be able to do that because i've already done them but when i need to fill in if y'all want to know uh or get a tutorial on how to do acrylics because i am a licensed cosmetologist even though i'm in the medical field um i can show y'all how to do um acrylic nails yourself without you know going to the shop and popping out that good money so anyway on to the um makeup tutorial if you want to know how to get this look which is this right here just keep watching all right First, we're going to um, apply um, a base. I've already primed prime my eye using Heart Candy's um, Sheer Envy um, Face Primer, which um, I don't have any other primer outside of that one. So I know about um, Urban Decay's primers and stuff like that, but y'all have any any drugstore ones? Because I've already planned on getting the Urban Decay one, but if any other drugstore brand um, primers that are excellent, y'all post me a comment, let me know so I can um, definitely give it a try. So anyway. I am going to start by grabbing my Sony Kashuk um, Large Crease Brush. And this color is extremely dark, so I'm going to be diluting this color like nobody's business. So I'm going to start with the crease. I'm also going to apply my base, which is ELF's um, Cream Shadows. I have depotted them, and I uh, put them in there. So I'm just going to put just a small amount because, y'all, these are very super, 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 super creamy. I'm just gonna brush it. I'm not gonna apply that all over my lid just because, like I said, yeah, my eyelids, my eyelids are already oily, and they will crease. So just the smallest amount on that brush. I'm gonna just start applying that to my crease. You see, it's super dark. Y'all see how dark that is? That is seriously dark. We are definitely gonna be diluting that color with um. I'm gonna be using my Max um, what Studio Fix uh, powder to um, dilute that because it's just so dark. And just a little bit more, so I can get that looking just right. So, yeah. And um, after the video, I will show y'all all the products that I have used for my face and my lips because I always have that done. I always have my powder and my foundation and my cheeks already applied. That way, um, I don't take up too much of your time um, applying, doing my whole face. I just, that would take forever because uh, I am not no makeup artist and it would just, would just be here forever just like a shower look but um if you did want me to do a separate um video on um how i apply my foundation or my face products i will there is one tutorial that i can't wait to do is like it's called like a summer kiss look and i did it the other day and oh my goodness i loved it it just looked like i had that summer glow like i had just been to the the beach or something and it was absolutely fabulous and this is my, um, I'm applying my um, MAC Studio Fix um, powder in NC45 to try to dilute that, um, you know, try to blend out those harsh lines. Because, like I said, that color is super, super dark. I thought it was a brown, but it's more like a, it's more like a black color, a black shadow with um, some bronze reflex in it. So it wound up being um, darker than I had anticipated. And um, it was just too, too dark to just, for me. It was more for a smoky eye, but if I'm going to be using my crease, I don't want it to be that dark. So I'm just going to apply that up like that and just get it uh, nice and blended out. And then I'm going to start applying my my brow bone, which is this color. Uh, my highlights color, I should say. I said my brow bone. It's a brow bone. And I'm going to be using my, um, what is this, uh, Walmart, just big old fluffy brush, which I love for applying uh, my highlight. I just love this brush for applying highlight. It works wonderfully and just awesome. And 
and um, if I have the time I may be doing another makeup posting another makeup tutorial today so I can try to get them out the way because I hate when I say I'm gonna do something and I just don't get around doing it and um, when I say I'm gonna do something I like to do it I don't like to be the ones that say I'm gonna do it and be like oh, I forgot oh, I got busy so I'm gonna try to see if I can get two tutorials done today and then um, post it up for y'all okay. I'm just gonna um, keep it flying until I get it looking the way I would like for it to look I'm just gonna add just the smallest amount more of this brown color right in there to deepen that crease I diluted it a little bit too much and I'm gonna blend it out And this is, y'all know, I use Sony Cash Looks Blender Brush always, always. Oh my goodness, y'all, I found a Sony Cash Look Brush the other day. <sighs> I know I said I wasn't going to do no more makeup hauls, and that's why I haven't even showed y'all the brush, but that brush is on point. I love it. When I'm finished, I'll show it to you. It's a small stippling brush, which is, oh my goodness, ideal for adding, um, a highlight or for adding, um, blush. I love it. And I have been looking for a brush like that for oh my goodness for forever and I was just about to order one online when I just so happened to see it oh that's loud sorry I got my window open I should have closed it but I did not so my bad on that so anyway I am going to start packing on that lid color which is that nice bright um, gold shadow and I'm going to be using that one brush I told you I ordered it from off of eBay. And I'm going to actually um, spray it with um, my Studio, uh, my MAC Fix Plus in Lavender, which I don't think, I don't know if they sell that anymore. I believe that might have been limited edition, but, you know, MAC always had Fix Plus, just a regular Fix Plus. So, started packing that on my lid. And I don't have no crazy stories to tell y'all today. I, last time I had a nice little crazy story about my phone being thrown in the daggone fish tank. And honey, I've been keeping a close eye on my phone at all times. It is connected to my hip because if it wound up in the fish tank again, oof, I'm going to go ahead and just turn myself in to jail or whatever because I'm going to hurt that creature. I am going to do something so unique to that child. So anyway, you see I've got the um, the lid color applied. And I am going to be using Elf's Liner in Black. Which y'all y'all know from my last haul, I um, picked up the Elf Liners. And these are on point. Like, so, oh my goodness, creamy. Really, really creamy. I love the consistency of that liner. I'm just going to apply a line. A thin line going across. I love, 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 love that liner. Yes, Elf is doing major things. I can't wait to try the other colors because y'all know I got the color in purple and then, um, was it midnight? And if you can see, um, Sasha might be lifting on us. Y'all know I named my wig Sasha. And if she's lifting and y'all see that, don't even just excuse her. Cause she is doing what she want to do and I do not have her tape down and I did not want to scare y'all with the set it off braids to the back <laughs> all right Oh, and y'all, those, um, remember the other, the haul that I did, the last haul that I did, the, um, with the, um, e.l.f., um, lip conditioners? Oh, my goodness. 
I need to do a review on those bad boys. They are, they don't, I wouldn't, I didn't think they were going to be as pigmented as they are, but they are awesome. I love them and they are just wonderful and I need to do a review on them. And my husband was like, he watched my video. He watched one of my videos and he was like, yeah, baby, you, your lips, they, they do something strange. They, they, they do sometimes be doing something strange. And I'm like, you don't, I don't need you to amen me. And touch and agree with me. That was not the whole purpose. <laughs> that I did not need for you to do that. But yes, it they work awesome. The only thing that I will say about them is they are a space hogger, especially if you have. And I'm applying uh, Maybelline's falsies. Um, yes, they are definitely a space hogger. The packaging is. I love the packaging on. I'm not gonna lie. I do love the packaging on them. They are very, um, very, very nicely packaged. But they are bulky, and. Um, they do hog up a lot of space. They do hog up a lot of space, but I've I've got them in a place. I rearranged my um my makeup the other day just because I just had it, was, it didn't need to be done. It needed to be organized just a little bit better. So I I went and um got some stuff to organize them, organize it and just kind of put things in a better place. And hopefully that I won't have to organize them for a while because I will not be purchasing any more makeup. But that's a lie and um. I will. So I'm not even gonna sit there and act like I'm not about to purchase no more makeup when I know I am. But hopefully it's not so much to where I have to um keep buying storage. And I'm telling y'all, I'm gonna I'm gonna fall out if I buy one more bronzer. I don't even understand why I'm keep buying all these daggone bronzers. And they are the bronzers I do have, especially the ones I, I use them, I love them, and I usually uh pick a different bronzer every day and now i'm going to be applying the um mega lash mascara to my bottom lid my bottom lashes to my bottom lid my bottom lashes you know what i mean that's like i told y'all this one is ideal for my bottom lashes like straight ideal for them they just they do just work fabulously i don't get usually i get a lot of um mascara actually on my bottom lid and not on the lashes and this gets just my lashes so it's perfect for that but in fact it's so perfect for that i don't even use this mascara for my top lids i just strictly use it for my bottom lashes and my baby pops out of the shot okay and that is it for the look Add just a little bit more. Let me see my lashes looking good. They popping. They are popping. How? Um, but that is it for the look. Let me hurry up and run through these products that I did use um, for my foundation. My bed. I should have been prepared. Y'all, y'all know I am never prepared. I always gotta reach back and um, grab something. I use my um, Maybelline Fit and 350. Y'all, this is working out lovely. I do, 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 do. I love this product. I. That's nice. I also used, so I used that for my um, foundation. Um, I also used this concealer. I didn't use my MAC concealer because I know it was going to be highlighting right here. And I used this Maybelline um, Fit Foundation and I believe, um, was it 355? And I used this right in here to give that a highlight here, here. And I think that was it. Um, then I used... Um, my CoverGirl Transparent um, Loose Powder, where I highlighted because I didn't want to cover that up. For powder on the rest of my face, this is a new product that I'm trying out. I just got it the other day, and I love it. This is the number seven. They sell this at um, Target. It was on sale for two dollars, y'all. And this is an almond, and I use that here wherever I didn't apply a highlight. I use that or foundation as a highlight. Um, for my blush, I use Elf's blush and um. Uh, fuchsia y'all was it fuchsia fusion if y'all don't have this this is off the chain it's a purple color and it's got some gold reflex it is beautiful y'all see that love it on my cheeks um and then i used this which was on sale number seven lipstick in um innocent it was on sale super dirt cheap and um that is pretty much it so um thanks for watching and as always don't forget to rate comment and subscribe Bye. Sorry I rushed y'all. Y'all know I'm, I got a limited time frame. Bye-bye. <laughs>